couple, Eric D. and Oak's cousin Courtney White, was visibly emotionally shaken during and after that hearing this morning here at the John Marshall Courthouse. Take a look. Oak's mom and dad gave hugs to family after a guilty plea from Andrew White, Oak's big brother in the Delta Chi fraternity. That's White walking into court today before pleading guilty to charges of unlawful hazing of a student and buying alcohol for a minor in connection to the February incident. Prosecutors said Oaks was ordered to chug an unusually strong drink. White made him at a frat party the night before. He was found dead in a house on West Clay Street. If the case had gone to trial, the defense would have argued there was conflicting evidence that some witnesses reported Oaks was having fun. In tears, Oaks' cousin Courtney White says today was her family's first glimmer of hope. I think it's emotional. But at the same time, I, I can't help but think it's only one of 11. There's other boys involved, and we still have a really, really long road ahead. Now seven of the other young men charged in this case will appear in court in February. And, of course, we'll be following those developments closely. For now, live in Richmond, Sabrina Shutters, 8 News.